cold drinks, that's the motherfucking recipe. Zebraliśmy cały zestaw, żeby dostać się do tego obozu ogrów. Teraz jesteśmy w nim. Co z kula zwaliliśmy? Co z głupsza zrobić? Jest taka opcja, to próbujesz, nie? You want to give me something? I can't do anything with that as long as I'm hanging here. But I'll help. Fallen onto my head, that would have been the end of me. If the ball had not just poor cheap cheap. One of the largest fortresses of evil awaits, but that'll yes, you on the go boxka. A, ona wyjdzie. No, ale jak muszę stąd wychodzić? Co się robi od mnie, to ma jakaś katapulta, ona nie zrobi to wystrzeli. Rozmawiaj z trolem. I cześć, co tam? Oh, she's funny. Wow. 
Podpal spodnie trola. <śmiech> Palcie czarnuchu głupi. A ty mały tam uczy. Siema. Proszę bardzo. Do zobaczenia. Kurde, nie za małe to miejsce. Yeah. Yeah. Teraz otworzymy Aiwa. Aiwa, kocham. Nie teraz o ręce się. Nie, o ku... O kurde, jaka ninja. Sorted at last, and now you don't need to do all the work on your own anymore. Because you find it just. Oh, thanks. Uh, just what I've always wanted. Pewnie pojdę na moją sprawę. Tylko że on gada tak dziwnie. Thanks. Kom v gardel tři mě zapálil na pochodu. Thanks. Satan. It is art. Oh. Something seems to be happening in the wall, but it doesn't really appear to be much help to us. Good rugu. Nothing. Nothing. Hmm. Yeah. This shaft must lead to the outside somewhere, oh, but it's too narrow and too high to use for climbing out. This shop. That's the skeleton of a. Uh, oh. I fear my own immortality has led to a deficiency in anatomical general knowledge. <laughs> mm, so. Let's say it was something like a halfling or a, a little human. Okay. The rubber chicken stretched out between the two posts. I could use it as a catapult, but what can I use as a shot? What? The rubber chickens. That's a big help. Oh, the cool chicka! A strange metal box. A smaller box is hanging inside it. Telephone. There are many symbols and short texts on the walls. I can't read them. No, no. Hmm. Strange pictures have been glued to the sides. And there's a large bit of paper with some text. Ah, oh, this doesn't mean anything to me. What is this? There's something lying in the cells. It's. Hello? Hello? Huh, nothing. Hanty slept through the whole cheap, cheap and critter hullabaloot. Hey! Ow! What? You? Oh, MacGuffin! But what are you doing? The artifact, is it safe? MacGuffin, you're still alive. You didn't appear to be very resilient during the interrogations. The book! The artifact! What's happened to it? I fetched the book from your cellar, but I haven't met the Archmage yet. And... and then? I made sure the artifact was taken to safety with two friends. Ah, excellent! So, it really was in the temple? Yes, it was. So? The Archmage has got the artifact, and you're now here to free me? Not quite. We were surprised by Monkus. My friends were able to escape with the artifact, but I was captured. Then... then it's still not safe? Perhaps not. This is a catastrophe! 
We've got to get out of here and take the artifact to the Archmage. You don't say. <laughs> Aren't you the tactical genius then? <laughs> Why are you always locked up every time we meet? Can't you free yourself once in a while? Mortroga magically sealed the lock herself. You can't open it with a toothpick. So you just sit in your cell and let me do all the work. Get me out of here and I can assist you. At least with moral support. So the lock's been magically sealed, but it should still be possible to open. Yes, of course, but you need the wand that sealed it for that. Mortroga's wand? I'm afraid so, yes. Uh, then let's just leave that lock as it is and- Good luck. Those are iron bars, as thick as trolls' thumbs. What did you tell Mortroga and her little devil? I didn't need to tell them much. They knew about the artifact. I... I told them about the book. But I was certain that you'd got that to safety long ago. And nothing else? And... and I told them about the ring. You told them about Wilbur! You really set her on the trail of a little gnome! I had no choice, but he had many hours head start. And you said yourself that he made it to the Archmage. And he's displayed much greater courage than you. <laughs> My companions Wilbur and Nate got out via a portal. Can one find out where that portal led them? A portal? Hmm. That kind of thing is rare. Only particularly powerful mages can open a portal. Wilbur has an amulet. The portal opened when it landed on the floor. Incredible. There are only two amulets that could accomplish something like that. One of them belonged to the powerful dark mage Balthazar, but that was presumed missing, just like its even more powerful brother the Talarion. It was Balthazar's amulet. Do you have any idea where it might have taken them? Hmm. I cannot answer that, but the Archmage would know. That's one more reason to talk with him soon. That red box over there, what use might it have? I was wondering about that myself. It looks very interesting. Purely on a scientific level, of course. It seems rather out of... Mortroga's kingdom is large. Many are bound to her by allegiance. Or perhaps she bagged it on one of her raids. Who knows? I have to go. There are bound to be other caged gremlins that need to be released. Very fun. <laughs> A small cell with strong iron bars, presumably for particularly dangerous prisoners. A small cell with strong iron... Hmm. I wouldn't even attempt this were it not... Firm. Oh, really? It's firmly bolted. <laughs> You reckon that the bar's too heavy for you to lift up? Huh. It'll need to be removed somehow. Ready to fire. Just missing my target. The door still locked. Do you still feel it? He's not even interested in the fact that I'm not chained up anymore. He knows that almost nothing can do any damage to a troll like him. The troll like him. Ready? 
Ready to. Zdjęcia kit. No, no. Direct hit. That's enough to knock out a troll for ages. Help me, will you? Let's push him into that cell there. Uh huh. That's it. <coughs> Come on, Critter. Onward. Napshot. Vatsko. Vatsko. Ale on był taki wielki, on go do taki małej klatki a heavy looking smithy's hammer. I don't wish to encounter the blacksmith that goes with this. No, no, no. Hmm, I could do that. Someone would notice the smoke and put the fire out. Critter and I'll just have to take care not to be. That should provide a bit of distraction. Lol. What the? Fire! Fire! No, 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 no. Damn nuisance! One of these days, this whole place is going to go up like a bonfire! Let's ensure that our little friend has a bit of. Oh. What the fire? What the fuck? You can't be laughing. It's fall out, I could. This is me. Damn nuisance! Why do I always have to deal with this? Hey, Mawa. This isn't going to work. I can't perform this sort of magic for someone who hasn't got magic in their blood. MacGuffin? What? Are you by any chance magically gifted? Crit has found a frost spell, but I can't use it. I'll have to pass on that. I'm not gifted with magic either. Who is nowadays? I have to go. There are very, very good. I can't really do anything with this spell. Look, really, zap, yes, it. Zamrazi te w minutę. Bum, 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 madafaka i zamrazione. Wyszedł, patrz. What am I going to do? What is he going to do? Astonishing. Quite astonishing. Magic. A teraz kopa. 
crit has worked hard. The bars have been magically frozen, but that's still not crit has worked. Oh, water. That could work. The bars are now frozen. This is Sparta. Freedom. Yeah. Disregarding the fact that we're still in a mighty fortress of evil, you are right. One step at a time. And that was an important one. Here's to the critter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and of course to you. Oh. Too kind. <laughs> it was a very clever idea to simply ignore the magically sealed lock. In my desperation, I tried to open it with this, but I didn't manage. What is it? My universal lockpick. That's a wire. <laughs> exactly. I've had it for years. It has served me well, cracking every lock thus far. It's taken a magically sealed lock to defeat it. McGuffin? Yes? Could I just borrow your universal lock picker? It seems to me that you don't fully appreciate it. It's a bit of what with which you can open almost any lock. These yeah, things are sacred to me, just like my whip. Speaking of which, where is it? I'll, uh, I'll tell you about that later. I need the wire. It'll help us get out of here. All right, then. What's the magic word? Please, oh, please give me the little piece of wire and do your bit. Very well. Just don't forget again. Quite a few inscriptions in that red box. I can try. Many of the inscriptions recount the daily lives of the people in whose midst this cabinet once it might have something to do with a primitive fertility ritual. Goodness. Some of the pictures would suggest that. And that white parchment on. Whoa. Out. What's wrong? This device here on the wall seems to be capable of connecting people over very long distances. <laughs> really? A kind of teleport? Yeah. Yes, yes. Here. Worldwide. Local. All that you need is a number. A number of another unit. And something like a small piece of gold as payment. That could be our ticket to freedom. Just what I was thinking. Could you get us out of here using that machine? Perhaps, but we need the number of another device like this and a small gold coin. I'll be as fast as I can. Excellent. Catch my attention. Use Vratzen. Just how are we meant to discover the number of a machine that. That's a good question. There must be records for this. Whoever put this device in here may also have hidden a list with the numbers of the other devices somewhere. What do you think? How many other machines like this exist? Who knows? There could be dozens of them. I have to go. Come to me. McGuffin, can you give the other... Good. Yeah. That should help things along. Sounds good to me. Let's see. A book. It's written in the same strange script as the words in the red box. Hey, look. This book was in a secret hiding place in the wall. Show me. The number we're searching for could be in there. And here it is. Here's the number of another device. What is it? Two. <laughs> uh, we would have been a long time guessing that. <laughs> now, we just need a gold coin. Now, we just need a gold coin. <laughs> Oh, 
I'll just take a few gold coins from the chest. I've got some gold coins here. Excellent. One of them's sure to fit. Give them to me. Now let's see them. Come in, you two. Come on. It's tight, but it's our path to freedom. All right, then. You're supposed to pick up this part here. <laughs> Stay calm. It's all completely normal. I hope. I'll put the coins in. All right, then. I'll enter the number. Works. Oh. Nada. Que eu quero levar vocês minutos depois. That was interesting. Completely ridiculous. <laughs> And now? To the Archmage! I'm going to go to the teleport. I'm going to go to the first one. I'm going to go to the teleport. Oh, okay! This is what I'm going Where are all the bloodthirsty orcs? <laughs> Yeah, well, I'm the only one left. That means I'm fighting you in the warrior contest? No, uh, someone's got to be the referee. So I don't have an opponent and have won without a fight? Not so fast! Zaz, Oh, Zazzy, love to see you. Have you put on a few pounds? <laughs> That human is mine. I'll be taking him to the Archwitch. You can't just take him. He's a warrior. Don't be daft. Uh-uh. Shield, sword and helmet say something different. Well, you don't say anything different at all. You aren't a warrior. What are you waiting for? Knock the green skin out. <laughs> He's a warrior. He's been let into our camp to take part in the warrior contest. As long as the contest is taking place, he is protected by our word. And since I don't seem to have an opponent, this contest is certainly going to last for some time yet. I, I shouldn't really have said that, should I? All right, then. The contest has begun. The opponents will compete in tests of strength, skill, and speed. You can do the tests at any time. If you leave the camp, you're disqualified. And can be freely shot. Oh, man. Stuff of dreams. You'll be hanging from the gallows this evening. But first, I'll relish so your ineptitude. Son of a nigga. She's having a ball. She's enjoying displaying her superiority over me. The tree stump seems to have been lying there so long it's sprouting. Isn't it sometimes astonishing how everything in the world seems to have a purpose? The tree has done its bit. I've got a branch and it's not much good for anything more. Almost an arrow already. Just an arrowhead missing. A tree trunk with a face painted on it. Maybe... Well, how the first contest is a test of strength. Not arm wrestling again. No, you will compete in the traditional orc sport of dwarf throwing. You throw the dwarf as far as you possibly can. Whoever throws it the furthest wins. 
That tree trunk there, that's the dwarf? Correct. A very good effort. No, Twelve foot! Excellent! Can't be all that heavy. <laughs> yeah? How about if we make this competition a little... I will participate with a handicap. Aren't your looks enough? That means that the Honorable Mazaz allows you as many attempts in each discipline as you like to try to improve on her performance. And if you manage just once, then you've immediately won the... Di okay, fine by me. Give me the dwarf. <laughs> uh, as many attempts as I like, yeah? Until the sun sets, then whoever's ahead has won. <laughs> I'll do the one honorable thing left to me. Cheat. Cheat. A termite mound. Considering they can be a heck of a lot bigger, this one isn't all... You're not all that impressive either. Huh? Who said that? Do you hear voices in your head? Not a good sign. Shut it. Down here, you ape. Who are you guys? Termites, of course. You can talk? Oh, you know... We've been around for hundreds of millions of years. Why shouldn't we be able to speak? You apes have learned how to do it too. What do you mean, apes? Humans were made 8,000 years ago by an invisible <laughs> wizard. Right, and you rule the planet. Planet? You know a thing or two about wood, don't you? How come this dwarf trunk is so heavy? An invisible wizard is pushing it towards the ground. I, I uh, don't think so. What do you expect? That thing is a solid tree trunk. They're always heavy. Could you maybe hollow it out a bit? Yeah, sure we could, but what do we get out of it? What would you like? Uh, a 1784 Shadow Latif board. What's that? Wood that was made into wine barrels, cupboards, coffins, etc. in the year 1784. 1784 is an extraordinarily good wood vintage. You can't be serious. Where am I supposed to find something like that? Your problem. I need to get going. Catch you later. Catch you later, ape. The pan still. The shell from a Galarian armored turtle. Those are man sized giant turtles which make fantastic armor and shields. I'm not going off with that. There's not a single bit of magic in that shield. They've got talking cows here. Why not talking goats as That's a kind of fry. That's the biggest tent in the camp. It has to be the chief. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Nate! What, what are you doing here? Saving your gnomish little neck. Yes, well, um, I... I thought you'd have been impressed that I hadn't just got the... You... you really considered just leaving me here? No! Well... Not exactly. Leave you here. But it was pretty difficult getting in here. I had to get hold of a sword. And there were earth pixies and dragons. I knew you'd come to rest. Yeah? Yes! You had it in you all the time. All you needed was a good reason to let it out. Let what out? Your heroic valor. Everyone has it. 
Very few ever dare to show it. It's not easy to be a true hero. Oh, Wilbur. All right, all right, all right. Calm down, untie me. No can do. I have to win a contest. For what contest? A warrior contest between me and Mazaz. You're the- Oh. It'll work out with all that heroic valor. Yes. Wait for me here. It won't be long and I'll be able to take you with me. If things go really well, in one piece even. <laughs> Mazaz. Back in a hurry. What's that? I think the hooded one just had a look at it too. Ah, it says a 1784 board from Chateau. What's its name? Suspicious. And how? You don't usually get anything gratis around here. Maybe it's a trap. Something. <laughs> Teraz kończę przynajmniej pierwszą konkurencję do końca odcinka. No to wszystko jest. Here, your chateau, you whatever board. A 1784 chateau latif. Oh, that's beauty, mate. Woohoo! That's it. The bouquet, the earthy scent. Oh, you primitive apes couldn't appreciate something like this, but connoisseurs would do anything for such a choice morsel. Okay, save me the wood gourmet routine and hollow out the dwarf. We'll do it. We could, of course, have taken out the orcs and freed the gnome for you. What? But that was just too complicated for your mammalian brain. Come on, lads, take us to the dwarf, King Kong. <laughs> You're such a... such a... Shut up! I've got everything under. Kurde, ale oni powiedzieli, że oni by mogli kurde nam załatwić tych tych orków. Hey boys, work to do. Okay, men, let's go. Attack! That ought to reduce the weight considerably. Hop, If the termites have done their job properly, the trunk should be about right. Hello, I'm ready for my second attempt. Oh. We're ready. Very impressive. He has cheated! No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No matter. My attempt went for... We'll measure it. Amazing. What? Twelve foot and six toes. The humans won! What? You must have measured incorrectly the first time, old man. Silence! I'm the referee in this contest and my word is final. The human won by six toes. The next contest is a test of skill. You were pretty good too, for a woman. <laughs> well... You just need a bit of luck. That was I think I've got a vague idea of what the next competition is. the test of. Ooh, how. You have to shoot an arrow into target. Oh, really? Out of the way, windbag. I never miss. Ten points for Mazaz. I haven't got a... A warrior without bow. <laughs> and while you're at it, an arrow, a keen eye, and a steady... And earplugs. Hmm, <laughs> Dobra, my skończymy w tym miejscu się więc obo na tyle w tym odcinku. Myślę, że wam się spodobało. Zapraszam was do innych segmentów dla was. Maxi, cześć!